Hello guys, this is Shazi from techscenarios.com. This is part two of how to make a very basic minimap using Unity 3D. Let's have a look what we did in the first part. So as you can see, we created a very basic minimap here. And as our player moves around in the environment, our minimap continuously updates itself. So that was the part one of this tutorial. But in the part two, we are going to make three changes. First of all, we are going to make this minimap circular and then we are going to create its boundary. And the third thing is, now you can see when we move our player around, uh, it can go outside the minimap, which is not very pretty. So we are going to tell our minimap camera to follow our player. So let's get into it. First of all, let's make our minimap circular. For this, go to the render texture of the minimap that we created in the first part and create an image game component as its child. As you can see, this is exactly the size of our minimap render texture. So get it out of the minimap and uh, place it under the minimap render texture and we have to import a circle now we have to add a component called mask let's not show the mask graphic okay and now we have to place minimap render texture as a child of minimap cover so now you can see our minimap is in circular form now for the second step of this tutorial let's make its boundary let's import this circular boundary make it sprite now we have to create a game object as minimap covers child and it will be an image let's assign outer circle to this image so that's all for the boundary now for the third part of this tutorial let's tell our minimap camera to follow our player so go to minimap camera and uncheck 2d mode now we have to tell our minimap camera to follow our player which is this little blue circle so for this we have to import a script let's import it it's called smooth follow and i will also give the link to this script in the comment section okay so this is a very simple script um we are just updating the position of our meaning map camera to the position of the target which will be our player game object and we have to set the speed in our inspector panels so let's head back to unity 3d and don't worry i will give the link to this script in the description you can download it now assign this smooth follow script to minimap camera and assign the player game object to our target and give it a try now you can see we can go as far as we want and our minimap camera will follow us so that's all for this part of this tutorial in the upcoming parts of this tutorial we are going to see how to add the enemies or your player game object or your allies or anything to this minimap uh, dynamically so that you don't have to hard code anything into your game and uh, we are going to do this through c sharp scripting and the other thing we are going to do is not to allow the enemies to fade away from the minimap as you can see now when we move away from the minimap like this so these enemies disappear from the minimap but we don't want that this does not look good and we lose track of the enemies so in the next part of this tutorial or the next next part of this tutorial we are going to resolve these issues if you have some other questions regarding this tutorial or another tutorial that you want to do 
then let me know in the comment section i hope you will subscribe to my channel